and tonight we are having hot pot. And once again, I fell in love with hot pot and I just can't wait to start going to other places and trying it out. So we are in Chantilly, Virginia and that's Bob White right behind us. Um, we are in Chantilly, Virginia. It's outside of DC. It's close to Fairfax area. It's close to Dulles Airport. Um, so if you have a layover here, uh, this might be a new place to try out. Anyway, I'm super excited, super hungry, super enthused. So that's a shout out to Jackie. Anyway, y'all, join us for Hot Pot. All right, so we just sat down. I took a look at the place for the sauces. It's showing you that. Um, we're gonna go up there again, and it's COVID friendly. They got some wax paper. She was explaining to us, you grab that wax paper after you sanitize your hands and you grab the ladle using it with that. So that's up to you. Also, they've got the scan me option. So you grab your cell phone. I'm not sure if you can see that, but you know what? If you can't, um, there you go, there you go, you can see it there, okay. So, they've got the QR code, you can take a look at that, it's $25 per person, two hours we get to sit and eat, and then we get um, a family pot, and we're doing a Tom Young broth, and we're also doing the Sichuan Mela broth, so, which is two different broths, and it's separated with a divider. Um, we're going to right now. We're going to sit in together and talk about what meats we want to get. If we want any seafood, any uh, any other uh, vegetables to go in it, and whatnot. So, ordered our drinks. I'm a little excited. I love hot pot. So it's fun to be here with others, and uh, it's best being here with uh, friends. server she let me know that she has her own special signature sauce sauce that she likes uh, and uh, I let her um, show me what it is and see if I can replicate it next time however I'm gonna take a picture of it I'm gonna show you what it is um, basically it's um, deliciousness in a bowl and I can't wait to stir it up and try it so we got this we're gonna own this let's see we've got a couple more meats that just joined us So this hot pot is hot. It's so good though, I'm telling you. Um, I messed up by putting a potato in here and the potato is not cooked all the way. So I uh, have some dumpling. All right, so I'm having some hot pot and I gotta use this little spoon that they gave me because my chopsticks are not working properly in my, uh, with my technique I'm using. So, cheers. Mm. Where were you all my flight? I love hot pot, love hot pot. I think I'm preferring it though at home using my Instapot so far. Um, if not my Instapot, somebody else's Instapot, but so far, that is great flavor, great taste. The, uh, it's really cool in here, but I think I can do a lot better at home with um, preparation. And, and we all like the same broth. So I will never not eat hot pot ever again. I love it, so. Mm. The sauce she gave me, it's a uh, sesame and um, some chili oil, some different stuff. Oh, so good. So delicious. All right, so I just 
had a tear jerker moment. It got in the back of my throat, the spiciness of the broth, and I'm at an Asian restaurant. It's the day after St. Patrick's Day, and so they've got Guinness beers here. They're half off. Um, my last hot pot place I went to, I did a bubble tea, and I was like, I, the bubble tea, they're so good. I wanted to try that, but I don't know. I just decided to do the beer. So delicious. But I highly recommend you do hot pot. I highly recommend it. I think though, you need to know what spice level before you arrive you can handle. And I also think that you need to know what beverage you can drink that will combat uh, combat that spice level. Um, so for me, something nice and cold, a water, uh, a beer, a bubble tea, something like that works for me. I don't drink milk. So if you can do something creamy, go for it. But for me, I'm gonna keep drinking this beer. I did order some water because I needed something in a hurry uh, that last time. Woo, it was bad. Anyway, take a look at our progress. Dinner was spectacular. We got our bill with three beers, a soda, water, three meals. Came out to what, 90, $92? $92, I think. Yeah. So, it's a little pricey. Be prepared for that, but it's so good. It's so worth it. I want to show you the aftermath. We made a mess. That's the difference of doing it at home and doing it here. There will be a mess. It's so Come on now, delicious soup. So, take a look. Anyway folks, such a great dinner. I'm so glad I was able to do this again. And I'm glad that I was able to do it with the people I'm doing it with. It's so tasty. I recommend the hot pot spot here in uh, Chantilly, Virginia. Delicious. Anyway, I hope that uh, you join us sometime and we can do this together. This is food you can make at home though. Take a look at your um, Instapot. Take a look at your crock pots. If it can get warm enough, Instapot, yes. It gets really, really warm and it's delicious. So, you like hot pot, you wanna do it at home? Look it up on YouTube how to do it at home. It's delicious. Anyway, if you like this video and others like it, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Click that bell so you'll get notified when our next video comes out. Folks, couldn't do this without you, and we thank you very much. Hit your friends up and let them know that we are here. Share it with them, too. Thanks. We'll catch you on the next time with the Traveling Jumpsuiters. Bye.